after an incredible and heartwarming experience in Sarajevo, which you can see here for yourself, it was a time for me to head back home to Belgrade, Serbia. A distance of roughly 300 kilometers that I had originally planned to take by bus. Although, at the last minute, I had a stroke of inspiration. This expanse of land covering East Bosnia and Western Serbia held many treasures and sites that had long been on my list of places that I wished to visit. And it seems to me like such a shame to pass right by them by bus, especially knowing that they were just an arm's length away. So, at the very last minute, I contacted a Sarajevo-based travel agency, Funky Tours, who organized for two expert guides to take me on a journey through this inspiring region of both countries, an adventure that we will take you on too. And by the end of it, if you like what you see, Funky Tours is just a reservation away. So, jump into your Golf Tours family because Funky Tours and I are taking you on a road trip through the Balkans. I will. Our story begins in the early morning from the Funky Tours office. Emir drives us out of Sarajevo along emerald rivers and a vast expanse of mountains and villages still draped in a pristine blanket of snow. Was Alim expertly begins to describe the main protagonist of our first destination, Visegrad. He explains the story of Yugoslavia's most celebrated writer and Nobel laureate, Ivo Andrić. His masterwork, The Bridge on the Drina, has earned him worldwide acclaim, and as we gaze upon the very bridge that inspired this timeless classic, we cannot help but be filled with a sense of wonder and awe. Behold, dear viewer, the Mehmed Pasha Sokolovic Bridge in Visegrad and the childhood haunt of our literary hero, Ivo Andrić. Consider this a must-read for any and all who seek to explore this wondrous land. Did you know that the renowned Serbian filmmaker Emir Kustorica has taken a particular interest in Andrić's masterpiece, so much so that he is currently working on a cinematic adaption of the novel. To bring his vision to life, he has even constructed a breathtaking mock town near the bridge, aptly named after the great writer himself. Emir Kustorica has a penchant for creating remarkable movie sets, as evidenced by his creation of Drvengrad, a unique town made entirely of wood located just across the Serbian border for his film Life is a Miracle. This movie also features the Shargan 8, originally part of a train line from Belgrade to Dubrovnik via Sarajevo. This part of the Shargan 8 is considered an engineering miracle due to overcoming the 300 meter height difference in a short period of time in a form of a figure 8. As we make our way back from Drvengrad, we couldn't resist stopping by another breathtaking natural landscape, Tara National Park. From Banska Stena Lookout, we gazed out at the stunning vista that stretched out before us. Neighbouring Bosnia, the natural border of two countries, Lake Perucic and the awe-inspiring Drina Canyon. And don't forget to snap some photos of this unforgettable view. It's even better in person. Not too far from there is the house on the Drina. The first house was built in 1968 by a group of boys seeking refuge from the hot summer days. And despite the river washing away six of these houses, a new and sturdier one was built each time. It is a symbol of the human spirit and the beauty of perseverance. 
After an exciting and jam-packed 12 hour a day of history lessons, laughter, good company and a little skiing, we finally arrived in Belgrade and it was time for me to bid farewell to my wonderful hosts. So thank you Funky Tours for making this adventure possible. They offer a wide variety of tours and transfers throughout the Balkans and I'm already planning my return trip in the spring for their wine experience and hiking tours, which are two separate tours by the way. So if you're traveling between cities in Serbia or Bosnia, take a transfer with Funky Tours. It's a fantastic way to explore parts of these countries that you wouldn't be able to see on your own with the added benefit of excellent company, incredibly knowledgeable guides and assistance with taking stunning photos along the way. So don't miss out on the chance to explore the Balkans with Funky Tours. I left all of the details in the description below so that you can start planning your adventure too. I for one cannot wait to return in May. And I hope to see you there too.